What's up, guys? Jay Little here for more Pack Crackers. Uh, it is yours for Thursday. It's also Ravnica Week yours for Thursday, where we're going to be opening up a Gate Crash uh, pack. Now, if I get a Mythic in this pack, I'm going to give it away to one of my lucky viewers. Uh, so, to have your chance to win this Mythic, a couple things you got to do. Uh, you got to be a subscriber to my YouTube channel. Pretty easy. You should see a subscribe button probably somewhere in that area over here. Um, you got to comment on the video, uh, and you got to like the video. And if you do those three things, you're entered in a chance to win whatever mythic I get, if I get any. And to be quite honest with you, there's not a lot of big money mythics in Gate Crash, like the the lands, the like the island swamp and the 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 plains uh, mountain or whatever. Uh, those types of cards, I guess shock lands. I don't know if they're called shock lands in the set or not, but anyway. Um, those are probably more expensive than any mythic. Like the highest cost mythic in the set is Hellkite, Hellkite Tyrant, which is like a seven or eight dollar card. So it's not a lot of money you're gonna win with it. But I mean, it's a free card, so whatever. Uh, but I'm gonna go through the commons uh, real quick for you here, uh, and the uncommons probably. We got Slaughterhorn. Remember, you can always pause and read about them if you want. Uh, Dutiful Thrall. Towering Thunderfist, uh, Basilica Screecher. Just found out that it's Basilica Screecher, not Basilica Screecher. Thank you, Google Translate. Uh, Paranoid De Delusions, that's a pretty good card, actually. That's not bad for Demir. Bit of a Demir. Got Wojak Halberders. Uh, uh, furious uh, Resistance, I almost said Ferocious. Furious Resistance. Riot Gear, meh. Ivy Lane Denison, really good uh, ulti um, unlimited elf combo with this card. You have this Presence of Gond, and you put the pres Presence of Gond on a uh, Devoted Druid. Devoted Druid lets you tap for a mana, untap, put a minus one, minus one counter on it, and do it again. Um, Presence of Gond says you can, uh, it's, it's an enchantment, you put it on a target creature, Devoted Druid in this case, and you can tap for a 1-1 one, one green elf uh, creature token. Uh, Ivy Lane Denison says uh, whenever another green uh, creature enters the battlefield, you put a plus one, plus one counter on the target creature, which you put on the Devoted Druid. Then you put a minus one, minus one counter on it to untap it, uh, which keeps it at the zero, two, or zero, three that it starts out as. Uh, then you tap it again for an elf token, put the counter that this one creates on the Devoted Druid, untap for minus one, so on and so forth, until you have 18 bazillion elves. And then you just go crazy with it we got clinging anemones a first in common sun home guild mage uh next in common homing lightning last in common smog elemental and hopefully a mythic nope it's a rare it's whispering madness uh it's two a blue and a black for sorcery each player discards his or her hand then draws cards equal to the greatest number of cards a player discarded this way and it has Cypher, which means you Cypher it onto a target creature. And whenever that creature does combat damage to a player, you do its stuff again. So no Mythic there. We got an Island and an Add card. So no Mythic for Ravnica Week, unfortunately. I think we had one for the last theme week we had, if I'm not mistaken. But no Ravnica Mythic. Um, but you know what? I'm not done opening packs today. We got a second chance to get a Mythic with dragon's maze um again and not a lot of big money mythics i think the 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 most costly mythic is master of cruelties which might be nine or ten dollars by now something like that um this came out like in 2013 as well i think um hopefully we'll get a mythic i'm, I'm doing back to back you know seeing if we can get a mythic um two of them for you guys and for ravnica week because go ravnica uh, but anyway, we got uh, Steeple Rock, uh, Mending Touch, Uncovered Clues, Golgari Clue Stone, <clears throat> Azorius Clue Stone. Can we get all five Clue Stones in one pack? Doesn't look like it. Hired Torturer, Crypt Incursion. Remember, you can pause and read about them if you want. Uh, Opal Lake Gatekeepers, uh, Crawl Warrior. Uh, we got ooh, uh, Splitters, a little Fuse Split, Alive and Well. As you can see here, you can pay the fuse costs, or you can pay fuse and pay both costs to cast both sides of the card. We got a Jelen Sphinx. He's Jelen. 
and last some common crisis incubation and hopefully my mythic oh it is a mythic it is reap intellect all right good thing we opened up another what is this oh it's a foil uh war leaders helix azorius guild mage or azorius guild gate and a centaur token uh, but let's talk about these reap intellect because we're giving away a mythic today guys uh reap intellect is uh x2 a blue and a black uh, for a sorcery, target opponent reveals his or her hand. You choose up to X non-land cards from it and exile them. For each card exiled this way, search that player's graveyard, hand, and library for any number of cards with the same name as that card and exile them. Then that player shuffles his or her library. So that's a really good way to screw somebody over. Especially if you know what kind of deck they're playing with and what they're doing with it. That's good. That's good. So I'm giving that away. And just to go over the rules one more time, uh, here's for Thursday. Uh, you have to be a subscriber to my channel. Uh, you got to comment and like this video on YouTube, not on Facebook. I might post it on Facebook, but make sure you do it on YouTube. Um, then, uh, once you do that, uh, this time next Thursday, I'm going to choose, maybe not exactly this time as when I'm posting it, but eventually next Thursday, I'm going to choose the winner of the the card uh, from those people who do those three things and i'll send it out to you now keep in mind international viewers unfortunately uh i can't help you out with the card so what we're going to do starting i guess now i suppose uh with yours for thursday is if i get a mythic card and an international viewer wins it what i'm going to do instead of sending this out because it's going to cost me more to send it out uh, than the card is actually worth um so what i'm going to do is i'm going to get you a tcg uh player dot com gift card equal to the cost of the of the card itself that way if you want one you can still buy it or you can use it for any other card you want but anyway guys make sure you comment like subscribe uh to for your chance to win this mythic and since we got a mythic uh Demir and a rare Demir card. Tell me your favorite Demir card from the Ravna cassettes in the comments below. Um Consuming Aberration is a good one. It's a really good one. I think that's from Demir. Yeah, that's from Demir, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. Anyway, uh, Consuming Aberration, if that's one of them, that's pretty that's pretty goo. Um I can't really think of any any kind of cipher cards. Like uh, I can't remember the name of it, but it's a it's a cipher card where you can return target creature card from your graveyard to your hand. And you cipher it on a creature that you know nobody's going to block, and then you attack, and you always get your creatures back. So that's cool. That's cool. But anyway, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Remember, keep on watching. You can keep on winning uh, like this Reap Intellect. So make sure you play along. I'll announce the winner next week. Later, guys.